Greetings and salutations from the Adventure Spot. We are at Bush Gardens Tampa Bay. Park 4 in our <laughs> theme park bonanza. We're really excited to be here. A lot of bucket list coasters. The main one Cheetah is Chase is yeah, back there, but... Cheetah Chase is there. And then I we, guess you I can't, can't see the rest can't of see, them uh, here. Gwazi, but Iron Gwazi we from saw here, that but... coming in and it yeah. looks huge. Yeah. Really looking forward to uh, to Gwazi. Mm -hmm. Uh, I am. Anyway. I know. I'll ride it. I will definitely so, ride it. Um, just, I don't know what else to say other than, oh, actually, I'll, I'll be getting my 100th coaster credit today. Assuming hopefully. everything yeah. is open and we get to I'm it all. I think I'm seven away, so. Yeah. And Becca got hers yesterday. yesterday. But other than that, uh, welcome to Bush Gardens. Tampa Bay. Our first ride of the day is going to be on Cheetah Hunt. And the nice thing about Bush Gardens and uh, SeaWorld as well, they have all day locker rental. For $10, you get a locker and you get to uh, transfer it to other lockers in the park. So it's not a bad deal. All right, our first ride of the day is done. We just got off of Cheetah Chase. <laughs> Awesome ride. I really enjoyed I it. I loved it. I yeah. feel like it's a good step up for um, for like kids who are looking for that in-between ride because yes, it has launches, but none of them are like super, super intense. Yeah. It's got a, some good hills, but I love again, that weaving in and out. Yeah, I, I mean, it's got a lot of elements that you'll find in the bigger coasters, but just not quite as extreme. Right. So I just thought it was just a blast to ride. Plus you can see all the animals. Yeah. Ah, loved it. Next up, we're getting ready to get on Cobra's Curse. A minute. Five minute away. Wow, this is the queue. Nice uh, air conditioned. This is of the two queues we've been in today. This is the better. We just got off of Cobra's Curse and... I have never laughed so hard on a ride in all my life. Becca enjoyed the spinnies. Oh my gosh, I, I laughed so hard I couldn't breathe. I enjoyed the just... It was just it, it was fun. fun. Yeah. Smooth ride. Yeah. yeah. And the, even the, as we were going through the queue, we only had a five minute wait, but... It wasn't even that yeah. long. I mean, as far as wait yeah. goes. But the queue was neat. They had yeah. nice theming in yeah. the queue as you're going. As my friend, who shall not be named, says when she gets tipsy, red 100. Okay. <laughs> Ride but, it. Yeah, definitely recommend this one. <laughs> Next up is Montu BNM Invert. And it'll be interesting to see how this compares to the other BNM Inverts. Especially at Bush Gardens, because right now that's, I think Alpen Geist is my favorite uh, at Bush Garden, Gardens Williamsburg. Alright, so we just got off Montu. We first rode the front row and then the back row. A great ride. It's my, I think, my new favorite BM invert. I don't know. Alpen Geist is really close, but this one might be better. I don't know. It's it's too hard for me to say. The front row was uh, I enjoyed it more than the back. The back was more intense, but I you couldn't see it. Yeah, I couldn't see it. And this is such a really awesome layout that when you're in the front row, being able to watch yeah. what's coming is so cool. And the, the tunnels are great. And the, oh my gosh, there's so much tunnel yeah. time. And, and versions. I and mean, I didn't get uh, too much head banginess. In the running. front, there was none. In the yeah. back, there was a little for me, probably because I'm shorter. It happens on every ride. But either way, you are going to get that awesome B&M roar. And it is a beautiful sound. Highly recommend this. So 
Yeah, this one in the middle is my favorite. He just hangs out here and bobs. He's like, hey, how's it going? So there is Falcon's Fury back in Pantopia, and I'm just devastated, heartbroken really, that it's not running today. Because Jonathan was going to ride it. I'm like, well, fine, if you're going to ride it, I'm going to ride it. But I don't want to ride it. Our next coaster is going to be the Sand Serpent. It's like a wild mouse. Uh, all right. Uh, we just got off Sand Serpent. Yeah, it's your typical uh, wild mouse. Mildly uh, painful, <laughs> uh, but a lot of fun. You know, I mean, yeah. it's gonna throw you. That's what yeah. it does. And it didn't but... break quite as bad as at the Some end. of the other ones. Yeah. That trim break in the middle though, yeah. that was that was a lot. Yeah. Fortunately um, I didn't bang my knee this time. I was kind aw. of racing. I did not. I know. Oh, I was racing for it this time, but anyway. Alright, <laughs> on to the next. Our next ride is gonna be Scorpion. We just got off the Scorpion. It was a fun ride. It was a lot less rough than it looks off. -ride. It was actually really smooth. Yeah. Uh, and it was a lot more fun than I expected. Yeah. I was like, oh, this is going to be rough. It's just going to be. No, it was so much fun. Um, yeah. I would recommend yeah, it. Yeah. yeah, I would do it again. Next up is Tigris. It's a skyrocket, and this will be my 99th coaster credit. So only one more to go to 100. All right, we just got off of Tigris. It's a skyrocket coaster similar to Tempesto, Tempesto at Busch Gardens Williamsburg. Uh, I enjoyed it. Um, thoughts? Um, so I don't love that hang time inversion at the top. Didn't love it in Tempesto, didn't love it in this. Um, it's just me, I don't like hanging upside down like that, you know. Um, but I love every other element of yeah, the ride. The launches so. were always, always, always fun to me. Yeah, but I mean, if you watch the POV, I think at the very top, I was like, don't like, <laughs> and then I was fine. So that's, that's and my that, review. Yeah. So we're, we're eating lunch at the Zambia Smokehouse. We got the Smokehouse Sampler. It comes with brisket, brisket rib, I think, rib. and uh, uh, barbecue chicken, maybe. Okay. So, go start with brisket. That's pretty tasty. I, I will eat that. And I don't normally eat my barbecue with a knife and fork, you know, but for you guys. Yeah. Manners. Mm. Really good, Red. Time has come. It'll be my 100th coaster credit and, and an awesome one at that, Iron Gwazi. I'm really looking forward to this one, RMC. We just got off of Iron Gwazi. So we rode it front row. And then I chickened out of doing a back row, and he did back row. I would say it's definitely probably. I would say definitely top ten, possibly top five of, 
my favorite roller coasters. I was time. nervous riding it because I do not like Twisted Timbers. I liked Steel Vengeance, but I didn't know what to expect with Steel Vengeance. So I was, I was just nervous riding it. And we got down the first hill and it was like, oh yeah, this is awesome. The back was definitely more intense. Yes. I prefer the front. I will not ride uh, the back. The back had a more ejector. Uh, yeah, it kind of worked <laughs> me over the first hill. And it's like that, yeah, definitely. It's a front row ride for me. Oh yeah. yeah. I'm not even <laughs> so. gonna ride back row. Um, you know, I'm riding it front row. That's a miracle. Let's <laughs> just accept it for what it yeah. is and be happy. My favorite roller coaster here so far, for sure. I'm gonna have to think on that one. We were gonna ride Shikra, but it's starting. It's to, raining. <laughs> it's raining, and the. Uh, <laughs> it feels so good. Except on the ride, it stings well. on the rides, but the GoPro doesn't do as well with the lighting conditions. But so we're gonna ride the train. Topiaries everywhere. There are a couple of butterflies. Where's the? Oh, I see. And there's one of the alligators here. There's, I see three. Oh no, there's four. There's one there. Yeah, and the one there, and then the one that was yeah. way over on the other side. Unless that's the same one. <sighs> That'll do it for day one at Bush Gardens. Tampa Bay. Tampa Bay, correct. We were able to get all the roller coasters except for one. Well, two. One of them was yeah, down, and right. one of them, it, the weather has turned inclement. So, but I got my 100th coaster credit. Iron Guazi, a great ride. And do you have any highlights for the day? Or um, any favorites? They've just got a really exceptional yeah. coaster lineup. But I feel it's important to point out the sign behind us. Um, I don't know if can they see that. Um, they do not have animals as big as roller coasters here. I just want to say that perspective is not accurate. I was disappointed. <laughs> but we'll be back tomorrow. We're going to try and get a couple of water rides plus the coasters that we missed. Then today. a few re rides. Yeah, so. And maybe just take a train ride and hopefully the sky ride's open too. Oh, that would be nice. But yeah, I have a feeling it. Don't think it'll, I don't think. Uh, and I'm, I'm betting money Kumba won't be up either. So, but fingers crossed. And until then, we will see, see you, you on, on our, our next, next adventure. adventure.